it's rightly said that Mrs. Pat cannot do this alone, but that is why we are here. Um, our government and the OAS has failed us. The OAS mandate is to keep the peace, to put in measures so that this doesn't happen. But also, I call on our security um, forces. They should be tracking our territory. We have a dispute on our territory, not just in this small area, but in our country. So we should be tracking our border lines. I don't know what they're doing. Um, but on our side, we say we stand firmly with Mrs. Pat and with any other Belizean that will be suffering this. We have other Belizeans that own land on this um, side of the border, and we don't know yet if they're suffering the same. We have to look into that and figure out, but um, for sure he cannot stand alone. So I make a call also to every Belizean and say this is not just... Mr. Spat being violated, Belizeans are being violated, and we should take that very personal, and we should bring that to government. Belizeans need to put pressure on our government and on the OAS. Send letters, send notes, you know, write to them, call them, tell them something, because if we sit, like Mr. Spat said, like sitting ducks, today it's Mr. Spat, tomorrow it might be any of us, any of us that live by the borderline.